Hello Bergen County, this is John Enslin at The Record wishing you a Happy New Year and bringing you the results of our annual poll of readers of the Bergen blog as to what they thought were the top 10 stories in Bergen County in 2015. At number 10, James Tedesco is sworn in as Bergen County's fifth county executive. At number 9, LG officials agree to a compromise on the height of their corporate headquarters in Englewood Cliffs. At number eight, three Democratic freeholders are re-elected, thus ensuring continued control of the board by their party. At number seven, former Democratic County Chairman Joe Ferriero is convicted following a trial in U.S. District Court in Newark. At number six, the IZOD Center in the Meadowlands is closed. At number five, Bergen County Prosecutor John Molinelli steps down after 14 years in the post. At number four, an epidemic of heroin deaths and addiction continues to grip the North Jersey region. Number three, Mercedes-Benz decides to leave Bergen County for Atlanta. Number two, the Bergen County Police Department is absorbed into the Bergen County Sheriff's Office. And number one, the top story of the year is chosen by our readers, the devastating fire at the Edgewater Avalon complex that routed hundreds of residents and led to calls for changes in building code laws. So there you have it, the top stories of 2015. I invite you to stay with the record this year and with NorthJersey.com for all your Bergen County news. Happy New Year, folks.